Good morning. It's Lisa. Every morning I wake up. I whisper or I say before my feet hit the floor, this is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. And then my, thought, my thoughts turn to praying for the lost and also for the ones that know our Father. But somehow they really don't think that he's returning. And I, I don't know if it was a vision or I, a revision and I heard his words, but I'll tell you what happened. I'm fully awake by this time. This was just a few minutes ago. And I saw a boat out on the water. And I saw our Father, our Savior, in the boat. And he was standing there with his hand reached out. And he said, didn't I tell you? Didn't, you, didn't I tell you I would, re, I would return in my word? Doesn't it say that? There's people who claim that, you know, we're fear mongers and, you know, it's just hateful things going around and families turning against families and or, or loved ones and getting angry and there's worry and strife. He says, didn't, didn't my word say this too? I made a promise to you that I would return to you. And while the waters are raging around you, I have my hand reached out. I'm calling you. I'm trying to save you. I promised you in my word that these things were to go going to come to pass. But my children are fearing my return. Some of them are, are fearing. They think they have a more important things. They're worried about their children. They're worried about their life. They have so much fear. But I didn't give you a spirit of fear. I told you I would take care of all. I asked you to trust me. I asked you to trust me. That's all you have to do. If you know me, you have no need to worry. To worry about your life. Or, or how you'll get by. Or what about your children? Don't you know I have all of these things in my hand? If you really trust me, grab hold of my life vesture. I am the life vesture. I am the way. I am the truth. I am the life. My promise wasn't for naught. And these waters that are raging around you and everything and my word that has come to pass and is coming to pass even before your eyes. All you have to do is trust me and hand everything over to me. That means everything. Not just your faith in knowing that I am who I say I am. But your faith in knowing that I do what I say I will do. And I keep the promises that I promised you. Grab hold of my vesture, the life vesture. Because even, even as the doors close, my hand will be reaching out for you. Come to me and know I love you more. I love you. I love you so much. And I. I love you all the same. There's no one greater than the other. My hand's extended to you all. Just trust me. For we know not the day nor the hour, but we know. He is coming. You know, the apostles, people thought they were crazy. Running around preaching about this Jesus, the Savior. People thought he was crazy. They knew a Messiah was coming, but they didn't believe them. Well, he knew the end from the beginning. And this too is coming to pass right before our eyes. 
brother will turn against brother and mother against father and son against father I mean, father against son son against father we're watching all of this pass right before our eyes we're watching everything unfold and it might be a scary thing and it might be heartbreaking especially to those whistleblowers those people blowing the trumpet in Zion warning all their friends and family and love and just utter love but we're willing to do that despite despite what happens to us because we know we know he's coming so grab hold of his vesture his life vesture he is the lifeboat.